to tell the truth, that's why they lying on my name, on my soul I can't lose control, when y'all do the most, what's my hope? I can't lose my soul, I can't lose no more Hi, right, yo, what is going on guys, and today we're back with another banger video and in today's video, as you can tell by the title, we do have a top 10 sneakers under $100 I don't know exactly what I titled this, just know it's 10 sneakers that I wanted to put y'all onto that are under $100 So something maybe you haven't seen, or it's just a shoe you didn't know was under $100 So if you guys want more top 10s, especially the under 100 ones, which I know you guys do like Leave a like on this video, get this video to 400 likes, just show some love, turn the phone, scroll down on your computer, do something, hit that like button It means a lot, thank you, appreciate you now, unlike the normal top 10s, I'm going to have a link to every single shoe. So if you do see a shoe that you like, the link will be in the description. It would mean a lot if y'all hit that link. You guys hit that link if you do want to purchase any of these shoes. Again, everything is under 100 and I actually, it actually will help out the channel a little bit. So if you want to hit the link, go down below and I'll have all the stuff linked. I'm going to start doing that more with my videos now where I will be able to link stuff like products that I talk about in the videos and you guys can go right into the description, hit the link and go cop if you guys want. So again, all the shoes are down below. But nonetheless, if you're new to the channel, make sure you take a second out of your day hit that subscribe button because we post every other day which is probably better than your favorite youtuber unless of course i'm your favorite youtuber now that all the talking is out of the way let's get into this top 10 we're coming in at number 10 we do have a pair of asics now i wanted to put i think i put two pairs of asics on this list but for this specific pair it is the gel mc plus now Something about the materials on here and this colorway I really did like. These you can find for $89, again, linked in the description, but you can find these for $89, and I actually do like this model a lot, like it looks very comfortable. I wear my ASIC gel Kaino 14s, those are the model that I wear all the time. I wear those literally like three times, I'm not even gassing it, three times a week. Whether I'm running out in the store, whether I'm just at work, whether I'm whatever I'm doing, I'm literally those go with everything. I love how comfortable they are. They just look very good, and I really do love Asics. Like Asics is kind of one of my favorite brands. Like on the low though, like I always forget about it. Like it kind of gets pushed to the back, but I feel like Asics is top three for me personally. So yeah, definitely a fire Asic. Link in description. Going to another brand, staying with the same kind of like theme. This is another company that like I've messed with since I was literally in middle school. Like I had multiple pairs of these. I used to go to the outlet for this shoe, and I used to. Be able to get this like two for like really really cheap it was like buy one get one 50 or something crazy like that it is Sakoni or Sakoni however you want to pronounce it these are the grid web mutants now I just again this literally reminds me of my Asics like the ones I actually have not the last pair but these ones right here are $70 which is not bad at all and I feel like you know if, if you don't want this pair definitely just check out Sakoni in general because I feel like they have so many good pairs that are under $100 that I'm just like damn this is just one that I saw that gives me that running shoe like dad feel like but then you wear it casual so it's not like too like you know not too much of a running shoe and not too much of a casual shoe it's like right in the middle and it just looks these are gonna look really good on feet like honestly yeah and this colorway is tough too it gives me very summer vibes so hey, if you want a summer running like you know comfortable shoe to wear definitely get these we might as well just keep the same theme we might as well this is another sneaker kind of same theme but this one is from nike it is the nike air ghost racer retro now i've talked about the air ghost racer like a minute ago like probably in a video like two three back in quarantine these were like these i kind of made these like a little bit hot not like crazy but i posted them on tiktok got like a decent amount of likes some people were copping them here and there because nike had like a sale they had these for like 50 dollars now these ones are like 65 because this is the retro pair um and i really do like them this is this is again a sneaker i've said literally since quarantine which is two years ago now that i've actually wanted to get this shoe so i really do like this and this colorway is tough i like the lime green with the hint of red but i like how mainly you get the white paneling overlay yeah these i like this too again you don't have to go with the exact colorways i'm showing y'all but i'm just showing you guys specific colorways that were cheaper so again if you do find other colorways it might be more or it might be less you never know i just like this colorway it looked good to me Next, we have the Adidas Consortium Human Made Master Human Made. I, again, I don't know, just a Human Made collab. And the reason I like this is because one, it gives me, it looks like a Stan Smith. I don't know if it's supposed to be a Stan Smith because it doesn't say it is. It says it's a Consortium. Story I don't know, but it looks like a Stan Smith to me with straps and hearts where the stripes would be. And it's a Human Made collab. These are $69, which is again, a really good price. And yeah, it's just an all white leather shoe. Figured I'd put it on the list. I like the way that these look. And I feel like the human made Adidas collabs get so slept on. Like there's so many good pairs from them. And I've talked, again, this is another shoe that I've talked about on previous top 10s and previous things where like the human made collabs might make their way onto it. Cause I just love the materials, the different things that they do with the models. Like they're just a very good like collaboration with Adidas. I don't know if y'all noticed, but this top 10 list, we've been like all over the place with brands. So if you guys like the diversity, let me know. I'm going crazy with the different brands. So we're going to pull up a brand that I'm actually very fond of, which you guys know if you watch the channel. 
Puma. These right here um, are the Puma RS 2K slip-on. So this is the kid super pair. I actually own these. This is a sneaker I actually own. They're in the closet right now. I don't feel like grabbing them, but just know throughout the fall and winter, these got worn. These are the most comfortable, one of the most comfortable shoes I have. They just look so good on feet. And every time I wore them, somebody either would stop me and be like, yo, what are those? Or they would just look at them or like, they, they just get reactions. And I really do like it. I like the Kid Super collabs. Again, another fire collaborator. Um, Kid Super makes his own fire stuff. But when he collabs with like Puma and stuff, he brings like literally the best out of Puma. So I have a lot of Kid Super stuff from the Puma collection. And these ones are actually $60. Again, hit the links in the description because I'm finding the crazy deals for y'all. So $60 for these is crazy. I'm not gonna lie, I think I paid retail and I think retail was like 100. So, hey, I lost money, but I'm saving y'all money. Going back to ASICs, we have the Tiger Gel Diablo OG. Now, these ones are $79. And I just thought this was a calm model. It's the it's one of the gel models, and I feel like anything ASIC gel, whatever, ASIC gel this, ASIC gel that is just like you just can't go wrong with them. And I really do like this colorway as well. Because it's not like a regular red, it kind of has more of like a burgundy feel to it. It's got like the cream ASICs logo, and then the model in general is just tough. These just look super comfortable. So yeah, $79 for these is not bad at all. Okay, hey, going over to Nike, we have something a little bit different. Again, you guys know I haven't really been messing with Nike like that. I feel like some of the models are eh here and there, but this is something different. This um this is the Nike Zoom Mock, and you guys can get these for seventy dollars. Again, links in the description. But like, I I don't know. They they're cool. I feel like some of y'all would rock with these. I don't know. I feel like some of you guys would actually mess with these. Maybe the colorway might be not it for some people, but I feel like the model itself is a tough shoe. Like especially for the especially for the summer. I feel like this is tough if you want like an obscure like foot. Like if you want an obscure piece of footwear. But I feel like fall is when these would really shine. Like these were like a nice pair of pants and just like the, I like the lacing system. I think that's why. And then like the way it's like a double tongue type feel. Yeah, these are just tough. It's something different. It's something a little bit weird. I figured I would just show y'all. Going back to Adidas, we have the Adidas Torsion Comp. Now this is just an all white leather pair of shoes. I figured I would show y'all. And these you could get for $50. So I was like, yeah, I'm, I'm just going to show you guys these. Because this is something different. I haven't really seen, I don't think I've ever seen this model to be honest with y'all. Um, it's just, it looks very bulky, but like sleek at the same time. So I thought it was a good shoe to show y'all. And I like the way the, the I like the way that the three stripes are, especially like I don't know, it has like this like crack in it, and it was like a little bit like not even, and it looks good. And I like this like little wedge piece that they have going on. I don't know for an all white shoe, fifty dollars you could wear this literally all year round. It's gonna be perfect. So hey, I think it's tough. Now, since it is summertime when I am dropping this video, I don't know when you were watching this video, but since it is summertime, I figured the last, last two things I would show y'all would be like a slide slash sandal type thing. So let's bring it back to Puma. This is the Puma Mirage Mock Sandal. These you can get for $50. And it's literally the Mirage um, Puma model. I don't know if you guys have ever seen that, but it's literally that. Like that side piece is literally what's on the, the actual sneaker, but it's a sandal. Looks cool. It's not your regular slide. I like how thick the front of it is. It gives me um, the Suyoko, Suko slide, whatever those are called. It gives me that type of feel. So I thought they were tough. Something a little bit different. I like these. I mean, number one, this is a sandal that I've actually wanted for the longest. It is the Nike ACG Air Deschaut. Again, don't know how to pronounce any of this. I'm linking it all in the description. So if you guys, you'll see the spelling down there. Don't know how to pronounce it. But these you can get for $60, and I really do like them. Um, this is something, again, I say it all the time, I know. But ACG is probably the best thing to come out of Nike, like, in terms of, like, clothing, shoes, just, like, utility wear. Like, they just make the best stuff. And especially these right here, like, these sandals are tough. Some of you guys might be like, eh, I don't know about that, Paul, but I feel like they're fire. So, in my opinion, a sandal that I've wanted for a minute, ACG, can't go wrong. I just love ACG. I got a little soft spot. Anyway, that is pretty much it for today. I hope you guys did enjoy. Appreciate y'all for watching. Again, I linked everything in the description. So anything that you guys did like and you're thinking about copping, just go check it out. Pretty much it for today. Hope you guys did enjoy. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. And we out. I wanna run up the money and love with the music I do with passion. You see me thumbing through hundreds for all this designer and love with the fashion.